All right, guys, so today we're taking Tamiya and her father, Scott, fishing. Scott's wheelchair bound and he also has inoperable bowel cancer. Now Scott loves fishing, but unfortunately he hasn't been able to get out there on the water and get a couple of dogs. So that's what we're here for today. We're gonna get Scott out on the water and show him a good afternoon and hopefully get a fish or two. And it's all thanks to you guys. Like I know I keep saying it, but no shit. Like without you guys, it's not possible, okay? So give yourselves a pat on the back. So make sure you keep supporting me. Become a member of LMCT. Do what you have to because it allows me to do this shit and I fucking love it. Not the best turning circle, is it? Nah. Mate, to be honest with you, ever since I've been sick, since 2013, I haven't been on a boat. I didn't tell him until last night, until after yeah. the confirmation yeah. and stuff. And mate, I fucking cried, you know yeah. what I mean? I'm like, is this for real or what, you know? Mm. He's like, where are we possibly going? I've been to all the theme parks. And I'm like, I'm not gonna take you to the theme park, Dad. I, I, oh, when did you tell him? Last night. Oh, did you? <laughs> he only found out yeah, last yeah, night. Yeah, yeah, I thought that, that was, Talking about going theme park or something, I thought, nah, I don't want to go that shit again, nah. you know what I mean? Nah. And then when they said going fishing with you guys, I went, oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nah, I reckon right about there. There you go, Scott. Oh, I can't throw it, mate, I'm good. I'll throw it for you. Yeah. I can do it. Whereabouts you want to go? Wherever you want to put it, mate. I reckon go over. I reckon go over there. Cheers, mate. There you go. Can you reel with the hand, that hand? No, no. So you have to reel one-handed? I can't reel, mate, either. I wonder if we can do it together. Oh, I might have to tighten that drag a little bit more, really. Very light line. Yeah. Oh, it's big. Oh, yeah, look at that. Oh, it's look at that. Oh, it's a ray. It's a Is it? It's a motherfucking ray. You know what? You hold it. I thought that was actually a fish because it was actually fighting like a fish. Yeah. yeah we were bringing that. it in and we were... Ah, bastard of a thing, eh? <sighs> what do you do with that fucking thing? Life's a funny one, you know. It's, yeah. um, unfortunately, as soon as we're born, there's a time limit. We're going to die. It's yeah, inevitable. We're that, all going to die. That's it, mate. You're born you know? to fucking die. <laughs> but we're just not prepared for it. Yeah, it's just, fuck, like I said... You see, I'm going to miss as much as to be fair. Yeah, your family. Yeah. You know. Do you, like, I always thought it'd be so much fucking easier if we knew what was after death. What the fuck is life? What is it? You know, they reckon you're going to be reborn and all this bullshit. Oh, like the reincarnation, yeah. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Oh, I'd fucking love that. Yeah, well, come. I want to come back as a stallion then. Oh, yeah, st I'd, oh, yeah stallion. I'll, I'll, I'll come back as a big fuck off three metre flatty. And I'll spike any cunt that catches me. I'm <laughs> <laughs> And I don't care if it's a fucking six year old kid that catches me, I'll spike the shit out of him. <laughs> what would be the first thing that you'd do if you were a stallion, Scott? What would you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're a beautiful fucking animal, aren't they? Yeah. Incredible. Need, need I say more? <laughs> you'd have the nibble on the grass and it'll look around. Like, oh, yeah. Let's say you've just, you've just, you've just passed, you've become a stallion, there you are, you're on a nice grassy knoll. What are you thinking? Um, to be honest with you, mate, which is the first bitch I'm going to ride? <laughs> Another stingy, maybe? Nah. It's a flatty. Nah, it's a brim. You got the net? Nah, it's a brim. It's a little brim. It's all right. Little brim. Mate, it's bloody great, isn't it? You know, it's definitely better than sitting at home every day. You don't want to kiss that? Nah. I might, can I? Do you go mind hard, mate, go yeah. hard. I might give him a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let him go. Now, fuck off. To do something like this, mate, not a lot of people would do this, mate, you know? I think that you can do as many drugs and get as drunk as many times and have sex with many women or blokes, whatever your preference, but you're not gonna get a better feeling than helping people. It's just... Bloody awesome, mate. It is, it's a privilege for, for me to take you fishing. Thanks for jumping on board mate, today, mate. Mate, thanks for having me over at a ball. Unfortunately, we didn't get many fish, but we had a great time. Yeah, we did, we had a great time. Yeah, we did. Now, I've also got something for you. I noticed you said on our first meeting here today you said that you didn't have a mobility scooter because you couldn't afford one yeah so I thought well let's get you one oh, 
fuck, bro. So that's going to make life a lot easier for you. And yeah, I hope it really helps you out, mate. I really oh, do. Oh, mate, fucking thank you very much. <laughs> that's all right. Thank you. No worries. And it's it's a machine. They, they're they top of the line, those ones. They're fucking great. Shit, thank you very much. Fuck, I didn't expect that, man. Glad to help out, mate. Fuck, really you made me fucking cry. <laughs> ah, it's a fire. Nah. Fucking hell. Nah, you're a nice bloke, mate, and you deserve it. I'm bloody real. Me and Adrian from LMCT Plus, we both bought this boat to give the people an opportunity that aren't able to get on a normal boat to go fishing. So a big thank you once again to all you guys because you make this possible. Thank you.